there's people here. This is scary, partner. This is weird. Let's go. Ah, welcome. I'm Voodoo Person. I'm gonna take your receptacle and enchant it with science and things. But I need a favor from you, please. Set the vessel down in front of me, please. Drop the vessel with all the Glorcon goo inside of it. Set it down in front of me. Just set the vessel down and... Ah, good work. Right where I asked you to place it. Right in the spot. Or close enough. Thank you very much. I need you to go to... There's a cursed village. The villagers' souls are tormented in everlasting pain. And they must be freed from their bodies to once again know peace. They walk the area of their village aimlessly, endlessly, and for eternity in pain and torment. Okay, all right, what do you want us to do? You have to go to the villagers and, and kill them, slay them, so their spirits will be freed and they can once again know peace fr from the pain and torment that they are eternally living in because they've been cursed. Partner, what do you think? All right, okay, thank you. We'll be back. All right, good luck you two, and as, while you're gone, I'll be hard at work enchanting this vial of Glorcon clone juice and getting it all primed and ready for the abstainers. Your boss told me all about it. I'm in the know. I'm all looped in with the, what's going on. Good luck. Have fun. Don't have too much fun. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. <sighs> oh, 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 my stomach. Oh, I feel the rumbling oh, from all the sticks that I put up inside of my anus hole. I can't believe we're killing these people, but I will say, at least we're getting to do it under this beautiful green sky, and the ground is sort of orangey, and the little their little houses are circular and orange. It's pretty. I mean, I do like, I do appreciate that. Hey, partner, maybe we should scope this place out before we kill anybody. You know, these villagers don't seem possessed. You know, they, 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 they seem fairly put together. You know, partner, you know, we don't have to kill these villagers. I mean, we'll still get the enchanted cauldron and all that stuff. Ooh, you are sucking these green power babies up. Man, you're a goddamn green power baby machine. people who reads those like can you find it books where's waldo books because you got a keen eye for these green power babies you really have a keen eye for these green power babies oh green power baby Tough to find. <laughs> Shit, that little motherfucker was hidden. <laughs> that son of a bitch was tucked away. Thank <laughs> you. 
Wow, you really worked to get this one. We're not gonna kill any of them. I hope Voodoo Person doesn't get upset. I mean, that's what we came here for. But whatever, you know, you're you're calling the shots. Let's go back to Voodoo Person. Oh my God! I can't believe it. I can't believe that I got another hit point. This is my fourth new hit point. I'm so strong now, partner. I'm so strong and I feel so good. Oh shit, y you managed to get all the green power babies here in this little cursed village. favorite smell. Oh, I've been jibbling the little schween ever since you two left. Come on into the little hut, you couple of hotties. I'm jibbling my schween right now. Oh, with my third arm. Get in here and help me jibble my schween. Oh, I got a third arm that's jibbling my schween right now while I was waiting for you to come in. Why don't you get in here and jibble my schween with me? Uh, voodoo person, we actually didn't kill anybody, be any of the villagers, because it just felt weird. They, they, they seemed totally fine. You didn't kill any of the villagers? Oh. oh. Their spirits will be trapped as they meander on oh, their little rectangular shaped huts that are dark gray and the red piercing blood red sky of their world. That's what it looked like, right? When you were there, that's what you saw? No? Well, what did it look like then? Uh, it, they had orange huts, and like, the sky was green, and the ground was sort of orangey and sandy, oh like- Oh my god. Oh, I gave you the wrong coordinates. Oh, you didn't kill anybody. Thank god. That's the village I go to get my dry cleaning done. Oh, thank god you didn't kill anybody. Or else I wouldn't even be able to get any of my dry cleaning stuff done. Okay, here's the vial of Glorcon guts. Uh, of Glorcon clone guts. You can take that to your- I voodooized it. And I did all a little magic to it. Now the abstainers will be able to use that, but thank God. They, they do my dry cleaning. They clean my house twice a week. They do my driveway. The, they do the uh, all the landscaping. Thank God you didn't kill them. All right, leave me the fuck alone. I'm a voodoo character. I got shit to do. Get the fuck out of my house. Get out of my place. I got shit to do. I'm a voodoo character. Partner, you gotta pick up the vessel. Just look at it and pick it up. Yeah, I'll tell you a story. I got a bad memory. I don't remember a lot of stuff. <laughs> get out of here. You guys get out of my hut. I'm, I'm sick of talking to you guys. Get the fuck out of here. Go play your stupid game and finish the dumb story. Piece of shits. Get out of here. I knew it! I knew there was something wrong about that village! I felt it in my gut! I was like, I don't know about this dude, and you were like, me too! God damn it! Can you believe this shit, partner? I mean, we could have wiped out an entire village because of that idiot voodoo person character! With her, with her gaping asshole! You probably didn't see it, but when I was running around in there, I saw her gaping giant asshole! It was insane! But anyways, we could have killed the village. It's insane we didn't do it. Thank God. And now we're and now we're partners here. We're like you're, you're a fucking scorpion. I'm an eye hole monster. What the fuck is this shit? You know what I mean? We don't. We, we uh, the likes of us don't ever get along in the cosmos. But here we are, an unlikely pairing. God damn, part. We are dialed in. We're a couple of buccaneers. You know? Oh shit! What the fuck's going on? Holy shit! Surprise! It's me, Glorcon, you fucking dumb pieces of shit! Oh my god! Trying to get your dogs back? Not gonna happen. See him in my eyes? They're fucking crying right now. It hurts them to be in my eyes. You guys are fucked. Fuck trying you! Trying to get my Glorcon clone guts? 
trying to fucking do one over on me? I don't think so. I'll be taking no! those. Fucking idiots. Can't believe the abstainers thought something this stupid would work. I'm a fucking god with your dogs in my eyes. I'll be right back. I've got a little surprise for you. Oh, while I'm away, look at the beautiful vista of my amazing Glorkon Palace base behind an incredibly powerful shield force field. I intercepted your pod and placed you in a nice spot with a good view of my fucking cool base of operations on this secret hidden planet. I'll be right back. Holy shit, partner! What the fuck are we supposed to do? Surprise! A little present for you Whoa, guys. What the fuck? You know what it is? It's a fucking bomb! Jesus Christ! And the second you arrive at the abstainer's location, it's gonna detonate. And it's gonna kill the three abstainers along with the two of you. Suck my giant Glorcon nuts, you fucking dipshits. Holy shit! Shit, partner, you gotta defuse that bomb. Defuse the bomb. Just do whatever, like hit buttons or figure it out. Uh, I, I, gotta, I gotta reroute the telepod. I gotta override the telepod. He's got us going straight for the abstainers. It's gonna kill the abstainers and, and you and me. Holy shit, it looks just like that damn puzzle from the tree trunk in the Schleamy world, the first level of the game. The fucking impossible puzzle. I thought we weren't gonna do that in this game. I thought, I thought we agreed we weren't gonna do those sorts of game mechanics in this game. That's not what this game's about. Jesus Christ. Why would they put another one of these in the game? It's not the fun thing to do in the game. It's not a fun thing to do in a video game. It's the hit buttons. It's like a quick time event. Yeah, well, uh, hello. Dragon Slayer from 1985 called. It wants its fucking lame quick time event bullshit. Whatever, who cares? Uh, I got it, I got it. The teleport doors are open. Fuck this bomb. Fuck this shit, I'm fucking this, I'm kicking it out. One, two, and a three, right out the fucking telepod door. Look at that fucking thing flying away. I overestimated this Glorcon character, or maybe I didn't, but whatever, either way, I'm pretty cemented on the fact that this guy's a fucking moron. Trover, Cherorpion, what happened? Glorcon intercepted the telepod, somehow brought us to his secret base and and then he put a bomb in the telepod, but get this. It was the world's shittiest fucking bomb. You know, it was a fucking piece of shit, you know what I mean? But I, but his intentions were to kill, you know, all of us. You know, me, the, the Cherorpion, the three of you. We were all supposed to die. I'm, I'm, I mean, that, that, that much is clear to me. But he's a fucking idiot and he, and he fucking fucked up because he's stupid. And that, and that makes me feel pretty good and comfortable. And relax. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness gracious. He's past the point of reasoning. He's gone mad. If Glorcon redirected the telepod to his secret base, then that means the telepod has Glorcon's secret base location embedded into it. And we can determine where his secret base is. Trover, Cherorpion, we must engage in a reconnect. It's a very risky and untested maneuver. No one knows exactly what happens when four abstainers get manually reconnected. But one thing is for sure, it will probably strip Glorcon of his agency and almost definitely fold his consciousness back into ours. Most likely. That sounds like some sort of plan. Here are special grab throw chair upgrade things. Spit on them. Ready? Three, two, one. Normally I'm into getting spit on. You know, it's kind of a turn on, but not by these guys, you know? Not too much of a fan of that. All right, you've just been endowed with the grab throw chair upgrade. It lets you grab and throw objects wherever you look. Where was this when Glorcon had a bomb strapped to our telepod? Shut your bitch ass up, Trover, before we smack you across the face backhanded like pimps do. That's right, we know about pimps. We are summoning four strange creatures. Here they are. These creatures are special. They're the crystallized large creatures. We only have four. You will need to go and find four more. But for now, I want you to pick these up and throw them into two of our eye holes, connecting two of us. Cherorpion, you must look at the crystal power, baby, and hold the R2 button to activate this new ability. Do it. Pick them up and throw the creatures into two of our eye holes. You'll notice a little arrow or arch or something. Line that up with our eye holes and then release the R2 button. That's how you throw things. Oh, good work. You're a real plugger. Uh, 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 mm. Oh, I want the crystal power babies in my eyes. Do me now. Oh, 
shit, yeah, oh, that baby's already kicking in. We are now merged. We feel very good. This is very nice. I feel very zen. You must go out and collect four more of the other special creatures. They will need to be plugged into this abstainer. What's up, dudes? It's me, Tyler. And Glorcon. Go now. Go, go get the other special creatures. Go. Hurry. Come on. All right, partner. Let, let, let's, let, let's leave them to it. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm all messed up back here. I, I'm all loopy as hell. Glorcon's one a hell of a villain. Oh, I don't like the way this place looks. I'm thinking I might need to do some rearranging of this place. I'm loopy as hell. Oh, I'm all messed up from not being connected from those creatures. Yeah, I'm a fucking shit show over here. I'm a shit show. I'm a regular old shit show. Partner, we should probably hurry up and find those other crystal power babies so we can merge this third abstainer with the other two. He seems kind of fucked up. Oh, you know I'm fucked up. Oh, man. Ooh, yeah. Oh, I feel all tingly. I'm so high. I feel high as hell. All right, partner, let's let's get a move on here. Oh, man. Oh, ooh, oh, 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 I'm all high. Oh, man, I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do all kinds of shit while you guys are gone. I'm gonna fucking redecorate this place. I'm gonna do so much shit. Partner, let's let's get let's go. Let's just get the f please. Let's continue with the adventure, shall we? Oh, you you guys continue with the adventure. I wanna get fucking. I'm so high right now. Jesus Christ, that one abstainer's all fucked up. Listen to him. Kind of makes me want to get drunk. I say we get drunk, partner. I say we get real drunk. Once we finish all this shit, I say we take a shot every level. Partner, that's the boss calling. Go ahead and answer it. Hello, Trover, Chair Orpian. You have to collect these special creatures, the crystally ones, that need to be plugged into the abstainer and Glorcon's eye holes. I found the location of a pair of them. They're in Flesh World. Flesh World. What is Flesh World? Well, could be any number of things. I, I truly have no idea. And I, it's not my job to know that. I don't give a shit. All I know is the computer I looked at located the crystal babies and they're in flesh world, and I'm gonna make sure the telepod gets you right near where they are. So you get out of the telepod on flesh world, and you fucking get the crystal babies, and let's just keep this horse moving. Now let's talk a little bit about flesh world. What is it? Is it flesh? Is it a world? Why not call it skin world? Why not call it skin planet? I don't know. It's not my job to name things. I'm the boss of this operation, okay? Now get the fuck out of my sight. I got shit to do. Fucking, I got a homework assignment. I'm doing a crossword puzzle for my book, for my teacher. I'm taking a night school class. See you guys in Flesh World, or I won't be there, but you know what I mean. Good luck in Flesh World. Man, I am just reeling at how stupid this Glorcon character is, you know? Thinks he's all tough. He might have your dogs plugged into his eyes and have superpowers, but... I'll tell you one superpower he doesn't have, the the superpower of intelligence. He's an idiot. That was the dumbest bomb I've ever seen in my life earlier that he tried to pull. Didn't do nothing. Now all we gotta do is find these crystal babies, and we'll be wrapped, well, this whole thing will be wrapped up real quick, and you'll be back home on your stupid chair place, and I'll be in my place, and we'll have distant memories of each other. Right, partner? You and me, distant memories. Jesus Christ, this fucking place looks like a cannibal's paradise, you know what I mean? Jeez, man, this whole situation's really getting out of hand, you know? It's one thing after the next. Get him, 
Get over here, you son of a bitch. Shit, yo. Hey, the, the, the source material you guys are made from is a fucking moron. You're all dumb. You can stop this tough customer. Oh, yeah, look at me. I'm gonna fuck you up, punk. Guys, all right, partner. Let's get inside this place and get that, get these fucking crystal babies. Hey, purple guy and Cheropian. I've heard of Cheropian. Wow, you really worked to get here. this one. Good on you. Hey, seriously, come over here. Oh, oh, hey, what's going on, bro? I'm Upgrade Teddy. You waiting for the zoo to open, too? That place ain't right. My baby bro went in there last week, and he never returned. I just hope he didn't forget his heart medication. Zabora leg, have you heard of it? It's the brand doctors trust most of the time. Speaking of time, I've been out here so damn long that I built this game. Want to give it a go? Here, you're going to need this power baby upgrade. Oh, shit, we got a power baby upgrade, partner. Let's get this puppy installed in me. Yeah, come on, bro. It's free. Take it. Come on, grab the power baby. Man, look at these little sons of bitches going at it. Oh my god, this is incredible. You know, if they put this on a sports network, I would watch it. I'd bet money on it. All right, you got the power baby upgrade. It's all installed. Now just hit the triangle button for a new heavy, sweet ass attack move. Press the triangle button to hit the bug in the air. Look at it and press R2, then toss it at the target. Simple fucking shit. Wait, before we do this, I just want to make sure these aren't your pets or anything, are they? What? No, who would have wild animals as pets? That's fucking crazy stupid shit. Aha, there you go. Got it. Hit all the targets and I'll hit you with a prize. Do you think my brother's dead? The zoo's been closed ever since that big ass spaceship showed up. Some big muscly stud muffins locked up. You know what? This great power baby was easy to get to. Him. Thank you. Know? you. I'm proud of you. But who cares about a bunch of grade A buff beefcakes locking up a flesh zoo? I want to get my baby bro, baby bro, baby bro back. And you missed it. Man, this was a tough little green power baby to get, and you pulled. Hold it off! Good work! I don't know what's going on. I've just been waiting for the zoo to fucking open so I can get my brother out. It's nice to see you guys are playing my game. It looks fun. I haven't even played it. Sure is a beautiful day for standing around and watching somebody not accomplish shit. Hey, did I ever tell you about the time me and my baby bro went to the mall? Oh, well, we did. He tried to jump over the second store railing. I couldn't believe it. I grabbed him by the shirt and caught him just as he was about to go over all the way down from the second floor. I don't know if you guys know what it's like to stand on a pile of sweaty flesh all day, but that's what I've been doing. And I'd describe it to you, but I just sort of did. Just standing around a pile of sweaty flesh all day. What a... Hey, look at that. You got them all. You get a free green power baby. Oh, don't you worry about me and those these green power babies. I'm going to take care of those. But first, we got to get inside this zoo. How are you going to get in? It's all locked up, stupid dumb. You think this is my first time breaking into a zoo, huh? I break into zoos all the time. I just broke into a zoo last week. Why? For the same reason I do everything. Criskets. I know they've got criskets in there. Uh, and I'm ready to get back on that horse. Oh, man. I had to stop eating those. They kept making me pee blood. I'm gonna take my pee pee blood and put it in a vial and give it to a doctor. <laughs> you guys didn't need to know that there's blood coming out of my pee pee hole right now. There's a puddle of pee pee blood by my feet. Don't look down. Oh. 
A squirrel must have buried this one away. Man, this place, you know, it's it's all squishy and wet here. There's veins everywhere. Not a fan of this place. It's wet and gross. That's all I got to say about it. You know, rumor has it that if you turn this world inside out, it looks like a 45-year-old bank teller. Huh, I wonder if Mrs. Poptons was here. Jeez, this place smells like raw chicken that was left in the trunk of a car. Uh, I don't know how we're getting in here. Holy shit, Fart. You open the gate. Look for my baby bro. Downgrade Donnie. Yeah, we'll be sure to keep an eye out for him. It smells like an abandoned retirement home where a bunch of old people died and started to decompose. Some help here. Hello, Trover Phillips. Gail, G Gail Jenkins. Wow, uh, it, it, it's been a while. It sure has, Trover. You look nice with those new power babies in your eyes. Uh, yeah, thanks. W w w what have you been up to, Gail? What does it look like I've been up to, Trover? I'm the head zookeeper of my own goddamn zoo. That's right. I'm keeping this zoo all by myself, and it's my fucking zoo. What have you been up to? Slumming it with a chair orpian, I see. So what are you, Trover's new roommate? I'm talking to you, chair orpian. Are you his new roommate? Yes or no? You know the system. Oh, well, be careful. If he treats you anything like he treated me, you'll be stuck paying last month's rent and the cleaning deposit. Listen, Gail, we're just here to see the crystal babies. Oh, you want to see the crystal babies? Well, go by all means on your own little way and find them. I'm sure you couldn't help but notice that the gate to the flesh safari is closed. But I'm not going to help you, Trover. If you were any other one of my zoo guests, I'd give you a lift. But guess what? Fuck you. Now let me get back to what I was doing a second ago. I was counting papers. Thanks, Gail. Okay, partner, let's figure out how to get this fucking... Flesh Safari door open. This seems like where Mrs. Poptons would hide a green power baby. Cut it out, Trevor. You can't hit my little creature. This isn't our old apartment. These green power babies, they don't hide themselves. Jesus Christ, I can't believe it's fucking my old roommate, Gail. I mean, sure, yeah, I ditched out on some of the rent money, but the guy's fucking insane, I'm telling you. He used to come into my bedroom and just scream about lasagna for no reason. He was, like, in a trance. I couldn't even talk to him. This is not good. We gotta get these fucking crystal babies. Get the fuck out of here. I'm telling you, this guy's fucking insane. One time he threw a party, said all his best friends were gonna be there. I came out of my room and I talked to people. Nobody knew who he was. I don't know where he found these people. I got the fuck out of there. You know what? I bet an elephant hit this one. Oh God, one time Gail brought home a random baby. He didn't even know who it belonged to. Put it in the sink. I just took off. Whoa! 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 One time he claimed that the stock photos in his picture frames were people that he sued. I bet a giraffe hit this one. He would leave notes everywhere, and they weren't even to me. They were to non-existent people about things that had happened in the apartment that didn't happen. It's 
really upset. He starts screaming about pizza nuggets, which doesn't make any sense because his father was a pizza nugget. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe, maybe there is a connection and that does make sense. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Partner. Good work, good work. Trover and Cherorpion opening my zoo park door and have fun and have a good time and I hope you find my crystal babies and get a good peep at them. This true zoo isn't easy to open. Is, isn't easy to keep open. I'm back to my taxes. Alright, Gail. Sorry. Let's go. Come on. We gotta move. I'm telling you, partner, I'm getting weird vibes about this place, you know? We should hurry up and get the crystal babies and get the hell out of here. I bet a cow. Moo. Hit this one. Smells a little funny. Must have been here for a while. That one smells a little funny. Must have been there for a while. you guys hey hey Cheropian look at me oh, you gotta get me out of this prison I don't belong here I'm innocent they're claiming that I killed my maid but I didn't she just uh, she just died all right so this is definitely a prison this is just great hey, you shut the hell up purple man Please, I'm in, I'm in desperate need of a lawyer. Can you help me? Do you know of any lawyers? Damn. All right, all right. Well, well maybe you can ask around or, or look for an ad on a, on a bus stop somewhere. Or a lot of good lawyers have their own bus stop ads. I mean, I, I'm, I'm, I'm talking numero uno ambulance chasers. So, so go look for a bus stop. Go look for some lawyer's bus stop ad. You, you try and find one that's wearing a wearing like a cowboy hat and a bolo tie because all the other good attorneys wear the cowboy hats and and bullet specifically the cowboy hats so keep keep an eye out for that all right go go hurry 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 hey stranger over here my name is Andy Dufrance, and I've been wrongfully accused of murder. You have to help me. No, listen, I'm sorry, but, you know, we're, we're busy. Fine. All right. I don't this need what I'm you. Talking about, I'll man. escape Thank by crawling you. through the sewage system. I'm talking three football fields of what? shit. Ugh, that's disgusting. Yeah, it's going to get real nasty up in there, splashing around in other people's shit and piss. Mm, I might even get a little bit in my mouth. Oh my god! I'm talking 900 feet of pure. Oh, you're taking off. Okay, bye. All right, green power, baby. Mama's gonna get stoned. Man, once this adventure's over, I'm gonna be wasted for a while. To deserve to be in this prison. Look 
at me over here. Hey, hey, come on. Come on, look over here. Psst, listen, listen to me. Come on. If you don't look, I'm not going to talk to you. If you don't look, I'm not going to talk to you. That's just how it works. Hey, hey, come here. You got to help me out. I shouldn't be here. I'm innocent. I didn't steal all those rakes. They said I stole a thousand rakes. Motherfucker, I don't even know what a rake is. Okay, let's keep going. Shut the fuck up, you purple bag of pus. I'm talking to the Cherokee. Do you believe I'm innocent? Tell me that you believe me. I need to know that. I swear to God, I'm telling the truth. Why would I steal a thousand? Why would I steal a thousand rakes? Do you know how much a hot rake goes for on the streets? They're worthless. You know what? If you don't believe me, think it's. Just leave. Leave. I said leave. I said I said leave. Get me out of this prison. I'm Junior Mint, bitch. Come closer and I'll refresh your mouth. Pissy shit piss. And poop and poo poo and pee and brown bad poop. Wow, I, what a beautiful lake. Huh, I wonder what that green stuff is. Probably better not to find out. What's going on? What the fuck? Oh, ha, ha, Trover, I knew you were coming all along. You play me for a dum-dum? I lived with you for how many oh, years? Oh, wonderful. Here we go. Here we go. You skipped out of my $240 rent and uh, whatever bill, and I'm angry with you. So I got in bed with these chicken nugget characters that I barely oh, know. those fucking guys. That's right. Gail's in bed with us. Uh, it's Gail. Gail, sorry. Gail's in bed with us. And you're fucked. Remember us? Yeah, fuck you. We're gonna fucking kill your fucking stupid ass. We have amazing train ninja level clone people now. What the fuck have we gotten ourselves into? You got yourself into a real shit pile of fuck. We're sending our toughest karate chop clone fighters in now. Oh, fuck, oh, partner. Damn. We gotta deal with this head on. That's right, Trover. You gotta deal with this head on. Because you're a fucking naked little purple whole eye hole monster. And you fucked me for $740. And I won't ever forget it. And I, and god damn, it's a coincidence. Or was it? Is it a coincidence or is it fate that brought us back together, Trover? Because I was sitting here running my zoo. It's all that's also where I live in. And all I will do animals that's not out of prison and then all of a sudden these chicken nugget characters showed up and they said we need help and i said what are you talking about and they said well there's this character named trover and this, and this cherubian and they're showing up to get those crystal babies that we care so much about and i was like what are you talking about, what are you talking about? <laughs> oh wonderful here we go here we go what are you talking about? What the fuck? You're not gonna get my crystal babies. And they told me that you, that you would get them. And we teamed them and made a purposefulest team. And we, 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 and you will, you were dead. You were gonna die. Fuck you, fuck. We're gonna fucking kill you. Yeah, we're gonna fucking murder you. And this is it. This is the fucking game over situation right here. You're fucking dead and dying tonight. Fuck you. Fucker. Today, I mean, it's, is it not night? It's not fucking daytime here right now. What the fuck? Well, fuck you. Maybe you don't know that Trover used to shit in my mouth when I slept at night. You wanted me to. You begged me to. What are you talking about? Oh, 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 I walked on him while he was jerking off to an episode of Judge Brown Crinkle. Oh, Judge Brown Crinkle gets my wrinkle hard. Partner, that's not true. Gail, you're lying again. Partner, I swear, Gail's making this stuff oh, up. Cherobian, maybe you don't know too much about Trover, your so-called partner. One time he brought home a dinkle, and it turned out to be a shinkle, and they still fucked. Oh, oh that's disgusting. Isn't that disgusting? How can you defend that? That's fucking gross. That's who your partner's with, Cherobian. Hey, listen, man, I was, that was a 
dark place I was in. I didn't know you were keeping a fucking journal about my life, you weirdo, Gale. Fuck you, Trova. You're gonna die today. You tried to come in here and steal my little crystal nugget babies. Fuck you. He doesn't close the shower curtain while he showers. Close the shower curtain from a stranger from another manger. You're gonna fucking die here, Trover. You're fucking dead as fuck, Trover. This is the dead end spot of the game. Fucking kill the last of our clone warriors. What? I signed a contract with you two. You specifically said you'd kill Trover and the Cherubian. Fuck you. I guess we're gonna have to go down and deal with this. I'll go first. All right, you go first. God damn it. Shut the fuck up, Gale. Fuck you. What the fuck is wrong with those guys? You knocked off some of my armor. It's not fair. You're not gonna get the power babies. There's no way we're gonna let you catch these power babies here. You're gonna die. I can't feel anything. I'm invincible. Trover, you know that just because you might be persevering doesn't mean that you're not a cherub. What? What are you talking about, Gale? You always said cherubians couldn't flip a rope. That's why they'd never be in gymnasticals in the Super Special Gymnast Alien Special Olympics. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I would never. Whoa, easy. There's the truth and then there's other stuff. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Trover, you son of a bitch. Good thing I made for a blackout plan. I'm gonna squirt out a bunch of little cube creatures out of these giant cubes that are up here. And they're gonna kill you. Just because those chicken nugget people couldn't do it doesn't mean I can't, Trover. You're fucked. Initiate little tiny cube monsters. Shields down, cube creatures go. That's it? That's all you've got, Gale? I'll get that $720, Trover, if it's the last thing I do. Oh. What are you doing? What are you? Why are you screaming, Gale? Uh, because, because. Jesus Christ, the fucking gossip mongerist. I mean, I mean, all the shit he was saying, you know, all bullshit. You know, one of the most offensive things I, I heard, aside from all the AIDS cum stuff, was that he was calling me a cherist. I'm not a cherist. I mean, one of my best friends was a Cherorpian, you know? Uh, you believe me, right, partner? Are you sure? Because, you know, you don't seem like that would, that you'd think that way. Would it help if I told you I slept with a Cherorpian? I slept with a Cherorpian. You know, we're buddies and we're, and we're friends and we're partners. Let's, let, let's, let's, let's get a move on. Let's get a hustle on. We gotta get these fucking crystal babies. And then, uh, I don't wanna be, I don't wanna be around you after that.